Emergency services in Brazil pulled off a dramatic rescue operation for a stranded horse during floods that have devastated the Rio Grande do Sol state. The horse, named Caramelo by social media users because of its tawny fur, had been stranded on a rooftop for six days. Caramelo was first spotted on top of the building by a news helicopter, prompting a nationwide appeal for her rescue. The horse had been balancing on two narrow strips of slippery asbestos for days in Canaus, a city in Porto Alegre, one of the hardest hit areas in the state. The emergency team, made up of firefighters and veterinarians, climbed onto the roof, sedated the 350 kilogram horse and lay her onto an inflatable raft. The operation involved four inflatable boats plus four support vessels carrying emergency teams. In the past week, Caramelo has become something of a symbol of the many domestic animals left high and dry in the devastating floods. The rescue operation came as a welcome sign of hope during a period of desolation caused by the floods, which have left over a hundred people dead. É, foram sedados pelos veterinários da Ubra, junto com os bombeiros de São Paulo, e colocados em bote, e trouxemos agora, vamos encaminhar lá para o hospital da Ubra. É, o nosso objetivo é salvar todas as vidas. Record rainfall and flooding has affected 1.45 million people and has left more than 230,000 displaced. In the city of Canaus, some 6,000 people have crowded into several university buildings which are serving as temporary shelters. Emergency teams have scrambled to rescue survivors and locate some of the 130 people reported missing, with much of the region isolated by floodwaters. According to some estimates, damages have reached $930 million in nearly 80% of Rio Grande do Sul's municipalities.